Hi there, Simon from SimonWoods.com. I have got a couple of wines here from the same stable, uh, from Fabre in Monmayu stable in, um, in, in Mendoza in, in Argentina. Um, and there's a tall bottle and there's a smaller bottle, but they're both the same price. Um, and uh, they both say Reservado, doesn't have any uh, legal meaning in, in Argentina. Uh, but one's Cabernet Franc and one's Cabernet Sauvignon. And I don't know if they are from uh, adjacent vineyards or anything like this. Um, they say that where the winery is in Lucan de Cujo, but I'm not sure whether that's where the, uh, the fruit is from. Anyway, let's give them a whirl and I'll do the Cabernet Franc first. I'll just have a check what the difference in, in, in the alcohol levels are. No, nope, both 14%, so uh, I'll do the smaller bottle first. Uh, so let's give the Cabernet Franc a whirl. Oh, vintage-wise, actually i better give you the full wine name. Fabre Monmayu Cabernet Franc Reservado 2015 Vintage. Dark berries, a bit of black currant, uh, a hint of cocoa. Um, and um, it's three years old now. We're in, in, in April 20, 2018, so three years since, since the grapes were picked, uh, and it still feels uh, like it's a, a juicy youngster. Uh, feel there's a little touch of reduction there that makes me think that um, I'll pour it out and it's going to get even better in, uh, uh, with time to, time to breathe. But um, it smells juicy. Uh, there is a little touch of um, uh, maybe some of the fruit has gone up a little bit dry, and uh, so there's a slight... Um, uh, as well as fresh fruit, there's a slightly slightly baked fruit edge, but uh, overall it's, it smells juicy and fresh. Good rather than great. Um, I miss maybe a little touch of the uh, Cabernet Franc uh, fragrance. Um, it may be that it's, it needs a little bit more time to open up, but um, the good, the really good Cabernet Francs that I've had from Argentina have been more fragrant than that and a little bit more um, relax. Here it feels quite controlled and um, it feels like a wine that someone has made but has, has uh, you know, someone knows how to make wine but maybe doesn't quite know when to uh, when to stop. Um, there is this perfectly pleasant flavours but it just feels it just feels a little bit a bit, bit controlled. Have another slug and see what I think. There's some of that leafy Cabernet Franc edge but um, maybe not enough of the floral edge that I'm, I'm, I'm looking for in the really good examples. Good enough. Um, second one, uh, so this is, um, it's not labelled Fabre Momayu, it's labelled HJ Fabre, but it's the same same organisation. Um, and it's Reservado Cabernet Sauvignon 2015, um, so let's give this one a whirl. Riper, plumper, plummier compared with the, uh, uh, the Cabernet Franc. Um, some there's almost a bit of it that maybe you've gone a little bit too ripe and you're getting some of these slightly um bruised almost yeah, maybe a touch of raisin fig in there as if uh, some of it's gone really ripe and squishy uh, but overall it smells a little bit more uh, ample than the cabernet Franc. yeah broader shouldered richer riper still a little bit of that control there um and um yeah, there's, a, there's still, um, it, it feels like somebody has um, reined the winemaking in and uh, been, sli I don't know whether they've been afraid of letting their, um, uh, a little bit of volatility or a little bit of funkiness get into the wine, but it feels like somebody has maybe polished it up a little bit too much before they, uh, they bottled it. And it, it could also be that in a few hours' time, uh, the, uh, both wines have suddenly sh uh, shaken off the, uh, uh, any any sickness that, or shock that they could have had by being in bottle for, um, uh, for a few months. So I'm going to try these, these later on with some, some friends of mine. So I will report back. As they are at the moment, um, there's just something about both of them that makes me think that there was uh, slightly better wines to be made with this, with this fruit. Um, so good, but not great. Hey, see you soon.